bet you love that. John goes out on his scooter. Today is a bright sunny day. John's going for a ride in his scooter. John likes riding his scooter. Janet says, make sure you wrap up well, John. It's not as warm as it looks. See, John put on a one-piece pink cashmere cat suit with mother of pearl buttons, <laughs> silver elbow patches, black furry ankle boots, a purple balaclava, a matching scarf. John is a pop and jay. Janet says, don't be late back. We have spaghetti and meatballs for lunch. John likes spaghetti and meatballs. See the sauce splashes on the ceiling. <laughs> John waves goodbye to Janet and scoots down the road as fast as he can, his scarf flapping in the breeze. I'm not skipping. Excellent. There's plenty of time for that. Now, when John gets to the village green, he stops outside the village store to get his breath back. He sees Mrs. Lowe, Mrs. Cook, and Mrs. Eisted. Eisted. Mrs. Eisted is standing by a bicycle with a flat tire. John says, Hello, lady. Can I help you, John? Kind, John. And Mrs. Cook says, uh, Mrs. Eisted has persuaded the parish council to buy this bicycle for use by any of the village residents. We were giving it a test run, and the tyre went flat. We have a puncture repair kit, but can't get the wheel undone, as it's bolted on too tightly. See John undo the wheel. See how strong John is. John helps the ladies to repair the puncture. See John put the wheel back on, and Mrs. Cook pumps up the tire. Mrs. Cook says, Thank you, John. <laughs> I keep this stirrup pump at my house if you ever need one for your scooter. Would, uh, would you like to test ride the bicycle, John? Yes, please, says John, gets on the bicycle. See John ride the bicycle round and round the village green as fast as he can. When John is quite tired, he brings the bicycle back to the ladies. Thank you very much, says John. Mrs. Lowe says... It's another voice. <laughs> she sounds like that. Oh, she's, she's, oh, I like the way yeah. you've planted your beard. She was, so a, that, <laughs> she was a welder. So it doesn't get in the way when you cycle. It looks very dashing. Perhaps you could let me ride on the handlebars like the lady in Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. <laughs> John says, I don't think so. I might fall off and break a nail. Soon it's time for John to go home for lunch. See John, scoot home as fast as he can. John is very hungry. And when John gets home, Janet is just stirring the sauce into the spaghetti, and Janet says, Did you have a nice time, John? Yes, says John. I stopped outside the village store and saw Mrs. Cook, Mrs. Lowe, and Mrs. Eisted. And Mrs. Cook offered me a go on the village bike. <laughs> Mrs. Eisted, <laughs> who soon had me mounted, and was telling me she was being sponsored by the council to give something to everyone in the village. <laughs> Mrs. Lowe said that she liked my whiskers and wanted to know if she could have a handlebar ride. And Mrs. Cook said she could let me have an old-fashioned hand pump if I needed one. <laughs> See Janet tip the hot spaghetti down John's catsuit. Hear the screams. <laughs> Poor John.